Hey there guys and welcome to another English lesson. Today we're going to be learning some new vocabulary and I have a really interesting British phrase for you. So let's get straight into it and learn some new vocabulary for you today. The words we're learning today are perfect examples of British English which you can use to impress your friends and sound like you're walking around the streets of London. And those words are knackered and shattered. I'm bloody knackered. Both of these words are adjectives and they are used to mean extremely tired or exhausted. Both of these words come from other meanings and we use them in this case to kind of mean that you have no energy, you're physically destroyed, you're mentally destroyed. So it's a way of exaggerating how tired and how exhausted you are. Knackered in the other meaning you means that it is damaged through use or it's worn out. So if your clothes are knackered, then they have lots of holes and maybe you need to replace them. You can also say, I knackered my wrist, meaning you damaged it and now it doesn't work properly. This camel's knackered. It keeps stopping every 10 minutes. We use this a lot in British English and the most common way is when we're talking about how tired we are when we want to exaggerate it. So you will normally hear this with lots of emotions and huffing and puffing and all that kind of stuff. Shattered is related to when you destroy glass. So you smash it and when it breaks into lots of pieces, it shatters. So imagine that your body is made of glass, you have a really tiring day and then someone comes and touches you and tsh, you break into a million pieces and you are shattered. Oh, I'm shattered. <laughs> Here are some examples I've prepared for you. I'm too knackered to go out this evening. When you're like, I can't be bothered, I'm tired, I don't want to go out. I'm too knackered. I'm absolutely shattered. It's been a long week. Absolutely with both of these words is really, really common if you want to make them even more extreme. And this works where if you normally say tired or exhausted, you can just replace them with these words. So they're really fantastic and easy to use. Finally, we have, by the time I got home, I was shattered. So you're dragging yourself through the door and just crawling into bed because you just have no energy left. And there we have it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. We have two new words that you can use every day to sound more British and to improve your English. But remember, to use these in conversation, you need to practice them. So write some example sentences and put them in the comments below the video so I can help you with any corrections and any questions that you have. And part of this process is always about staying positive and remember that we will reach the goal at some point in the future if we continue to work hard together. And the mantra, say it with me, I can become fluent, I will become fluent and I must become fluent. There we have it, the end of the short vocabulary lesson today. And if you have any questions, put them in the comments below the video and I'll be more than happy to help you out. If you're watching on YouTube, have a fantastic day, have a great day learning English, and if you're on Twitch, let's keep going!